now from the Boston Museum of Science, SciTech Today on NECN. In SciTech Today, scientists in Sweden have developed a super fast charging battery made from the most unlikely of materials, algae. Join me now from the museum's Gordon Current Science and Technology Center is Alex Fiorentino, our nanotechnology correspondent. So Alex, tell us about this algae-based battery. Uh, well, Beth, for just about as long as people have been using batteries, uh, we've been trying to make them last longer. So just think of our, our friend, the uh, Energizer Bunny here. But nowadays, it's really not enough to have a, uh, a long-lasting battery. We also want our batteries to charge quickly. Nobody wants to get stuck on a cell phone that, that hasn't charged or uh, get stuck on a connecting flight with a dead laptop. Or like waiting for your iPod to recharge before you go to the gym. Exactly. So Dr. Maria Strom and her colleagues at Uppsala University in Sweden have started looking into making battery electrodes out of paper but not just any old paper like this. They actually made paper electrodes out of a, a f the fiber from common kind of foul smelling algae that they pulled right out of the Baltic Sea. So why would they decide to use algae? Uh, well, if you were to zoom way in on some of this algae-based paper, you'd see that it's made of millions of finely nanostructured uh, tiny fibers. Uh, some of these are thousands of times thinner than a human hair. Uh, and so this algae-based paper is much more highly textured than regular paper. We kind of like the, the difference between this scrub pad and this piece of cardboard, only on a much, much smaller scale. Yeah, you can see the difference, but why, how does that make a battery recharge faster? Uh, well, if you run that animation we sent, I'll show you. All right, let's take the animation. When you plug in your battery charger, what it's doing is reloading the negative electrode with negative ions. In typical batteries, the electrodes are made of metal, and recharging can take minutes or hours. In this new battery, the electrodes are paper made of algae, and they absorb the ions much more quickly. The battery can recharge in as little as 11 seconds. The key here is the nanoscale textured surface of the algae paper, which provides lots of surface area for the ions to attach to. In this way, they can move in and out of the electrodes quickly, generating a very rapid recharge. Wow, so 11 seconds. When can we get these algae batteries? Uh, well, you can expect them even possibly within three years. Um, but at, at this stage, they're really still doing the basic science of it. Um, so, uh, so far they are not quite high enough voltage and not enough capacity to run anything like an iPod or something like that. Um, but you have to start somewhere. And so these, these ba batteries are already able to be very, very lightweight and very flexible. Um, and so, and so um, they, they already could be perfect for running things like medical implants or, or uh, sensors or any other device that's very small and requires a constant low source of voltage. What about uh, how safe they are? We're told now to keep batteries out of the trash because of some of the toxic chemicals inside batteries. So what about these algae batteries? How safe are they? Right. So these batteries are made mostly out of paper, algae, and salt water. So not only should they be very cheap and, and easy to make in almost any part of the world, they also should be very environmentally friendly. Alex Fiorentino, good to see you. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks for having me, Beth.